Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. This is Sammy from Sinomark Heavy Industry. Today let's talk about the Sinomark 21 tons excavator without any movement. Let's check it out right now. When you are ready to work after I started the excavator and switched on pilot protection lock, but you find the two pilots are not responding, even the working system not work. Please be calm down and follow the steps to find out the problem. This kind of failure can be identified as electrical system and hydraulic system. We will check from electrical system firstly. When you meet the problem, as I mentioned, please check here. The pilot oil supply valve beside the main pump. As you can see, there are three same magnetic valves under it. The inside one is pilot safety valve, which function is to control pilot oil supply and connected with pilot protection lock. The middle one is speed control valve of driving system, which high speed and low speed of excavator can be adjusted. The function of the outside one is for controlling the supercharge of the main pump. Disconnect the plug under the safety valve. Check power supply by multimeter. If we know more, we can identify the problem from the magnetic valve itself. In case we were working outside and didn't want to stop construction work, we can replace the valve with middle valve which controls the speed temporarily so that work not delayed. If the power supply is not in normal, then we come to the fuse box. Find if the fuse matched with pilot safety valve is damaged or not. If fuse is in good condition, let's open the head cover of pilot joystick and find the plug under pilot safety valve. Disconnect the plug and test the power supply by multimeter. If not in normal, we can say that the switch of pilot safety lock needs to be replaced. Alright, let's continue with the hydraulic system. We need to check if the hydraulic oil level enough to move the machine. Hydraulic oil filter and the pilot oil filter conditions. Check the pilot oil pressure by gauge, which should be between 3.8 to 4 MPa. In case still failure after above checking, please contact us directly. Okay, that's all for today. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up and leave your comments below. Tell your friends and subscribe to my channel. More videos will be coming up. This is Sammy. See you guys.